town hall was full to bursting. England students boxer, Alex Meta. In the dark blue corner, the boxers, the boys of Oxford. In the light blue, the old enemy, Cambridge, the Tabs. Oxford have won the last 10 years in a row. Cambridge are very, very keen to beat us this year. Both teams are very well matched and it's going to be a very competitive night. What's it like out there in the ring? What's the sort of feeling like? What's the rivalry? The tension is electric. Speaking from experience, when you step in the ring, you've never been so alone and yet you've never been with so many people. The varsity boxing match is fought out over nine bouts from featherweight to heavyweight. First man in the ring for Oxford, Chris Hampson. It's going to be good. It's been, it's been hard work, both mentally and physically. I mean, the, the constantly having to push yourself sort of further and harder and longer than you've ever gone before is very, very challenging, um, but, but worthwhile. And I'm so, I'm so looking forward to this. You're going to win? Oh, yes. No doubt. And what a fight it was to get the night going. The crowd loved it. The Cambridge man, Richard Platt, came out punching, but Chris Hampson's will to win was something else. The rivalry was just as hot outside the ring. And soon it was the Oxford cheers that raised the roof as the ref stopped the fight in the second round. Cambridge were out for the count. I may well have been more skillful boxer than me, but we really learn how to put everything into it, how to keep on going. Now, just like I said, you're early, always going to win. To push yourself harder and further than you've ever been before, and that's what you have to do. And you won. And if you got it, you win. Yeah, I won. It's good. Damn good feeling. While Oxford were running away with the lightweight contest, one of their top men, Alex Meta, was getting himself ready. He's been here before and knows the ropes. A lot of people might not sort of make the equation between Oxford University, academics right. and boxing. Well, I mean, I, I'm doing a PhD in law myself, um, and believe me, there's nothing I like better doing after being the bodleian all day, reading crusty law statute books this big, full of dust, is getting in the gym, wrapping up my hands and hitting hell out of a punch bag. It's the perfect antidote to uh, academic work, absolutely. I'd be unbalanced without it. So what's the message to Cambridge? <laughs> uh, in the words of, Pr of Prince Nassim Hamid, watch out, just watch out, this is totally professional. <laughs> and Alex had to be totally professional to win his light welterweight bout against Jimmy Cartwright of Cambridge. The crowd loved it, some had been waiting a long time, come a long way for this. I think it's wonderful, I'm from America, I came over here just to watch my nephew fight his last fight. And uh, it's superb, the atmosphere, the building, is beautiful. Is he going to win? Huh? Is he going to win? Yes, he's going to win. I bet my do bottom dollar he's going to win. Yes. Come on, Oxford, let's go, Alex! Hey! Uncle was right, the fight went the distance and Alex won on points. What a picture. Yeah, yeah, it was, uh, it was a hard fight though, he's a good, good boy, he'll go well, hope he carries on. Just hope we don't meet him again. And your family was there cheering you on, your uncle was from America? Yeah, my, my folks have flown over, especially from Atlanta, for, uh, for ten days, just to watch me get beaten up, I guess. I'm, <laughs> they hate me that much, hey? Hey, Oxford's night. Uh, it is going to be Oxford's night. 3-0 uh, at the moment, what's going to be 4-0 in a few minutes time? Just watch this space, kids. <laughs> The boys good at predictions too. Oxford won the welterweight contest and it was 4-0. Cambridge did make a comeback, but the light blues didn't really have much to sing about. Ringside was the Labour Shadow Minister of Sport, Tom Pendry. It was like turning the clock back for him. He used to box for Oxford. It is a very special occasion. It's, it reminds me very much of the old music hall, you know, with the balcony there and the chanting and the camaraderie. Uh, I think it's all that's good in boxing. Uh, everyone respects one another, all the boxers respect one another, and they give their all. 
and uh, it, uh, I think, just show boxing up in the very, very best light. It finished Oxford 6, Cambridge 3. Victory for the Dark Blues, and in history, they're all square two. We are now level 43-43. Looking forward to the next match next year, the centenary of the clubs. Let's hope we can pull ahead for the first time in a long time. What a time. night, I mean, the town hall room. What can you say? What can you say? You're here again, Tim. I hope we're here again in two years' time. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, and if you want to be here next time, you'd better book now. It'll be another sellout. And that was some night. The next big university contest is, of course, the boat race in three weeks' time. We're back on Monday with all the weekend's action.